Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Today I am doing a giveaway. So recently I have been getting new copies of a lot of my favorite fantasy books, upgrading like hardcovers and things like that. So I figured I would give away my old copies. I have five books I'm going to be giving away and they are all like my favorite fantasy books of all time. So I thought I would share them and give somebody the opportunity to read them as well. Just as a word of warning, these are my personal used copies, so sometimes they might have bent pages or, you know, the spines might be a little worn in, things like that, but there's nothing really honestly wrong with them. The first book I'm going to be giving away is Stardust by Neil Gaiman. This is one of my favorite, just standalone, fun, like, fairy tale feeling adventure fantasy books. It is such a fun, cute book. It's about a boy named Tristan who is in love with this girl who's kind of a meanie and she won't marry him and when he's trying to convince her a shooting star goes by and he promises that he will bring her back that star and if he does she'll marry him. So he goes on this quest over the wall and on the other side of the wall is like fantasy land basically. <laughs> so he goes after this fallen star and finds that it is a girl and then they have to travel back and there's witches after her because they can use her life force kind of to give them longer lives and there's sky pirates and it's just such a fun fun book. I'm a huge fan of Neil Gaiman stuff but this one is one of my favorites. I just think it is so so fun. The next book I'm giving away is The Way of Kings by Brandon Sanderson. I actually have not read this book yet but I'm giving this one away because I got a hardcover copy from Book Outlet for really cheap and I really, really love Brandon Sanderson's stuff. I'm actually hoping to read this book this month, but I'm not sure. So I don't know much about this book. I know Brandon Sanderson did Mistborn, which was fantastic. I just bought Steelheart, so I'll be reading that. And a lot of people that like his other stuff or fantasy at all are huge fans of this book. The next book I'm giving away is Wizard's First Rule by Terry Goodkin. This is one of my favorite epic fantasies of all time. I love this book so much. It's part of a really huge long series and I've only read the first one so far. I own a whole bunch of the rest, but I just love this one so much that I haven't continued. I know that sounds really weird, but I know I will someday. There was a sci-fi channel show about this book called Legend of the Seeker, I think, and it was, I'm sure it was horribly dorky and got canceled but this book is fantastic. There's this man named Richard and he lives in a land where magic is no longer there. There's kind of like these bubbles almost like dividing the land so a woman crosses over from where there is magic which is not supposed to happen. There's no way that that's possible and she is a confessor so well I don't want to tell you because what she can do is kind of part of the story but they go on like a quest together to try to stop this evil, evil tyrant and it's so good, you guys. This is a huge book. This one right here is 836 pages, but it is so fantastic. There's so much interesting like world building and powers and it's so great. This one is one of my favorite fantasy books. The next book I'm giving away is a copy of Aragon by Christopher Paulini. I have not read Lord of the Rings, but I know people that don't like these books say that it seems like he copied from Lord of the Rings. I don't know, I couldn't say, but I can say that I really, really love these books. These books hold kind of a special place in my heart because they were some of the first fantasy books I ever fell in love with, if not the first. So I love these. It's about a boy named Aragon who finds a dragon egg and supposedly all of the dragon riders are dead except for the King Galbatorix because he killed them all off so he could have the ultimate power. So he now has a duty to become a dragon rider and to try to reclaim the land and defeat him and there's elves and there's dwarves and there's this beautiful world and there's magic and... I love these books. I love these books so much. They are so, so good. The last book that I'm giving away is a copy of The Golden Compass by Philip Pullman. These books I loved when I was younger and I still read them occasionally because they are so beautiful. Usually I only read the last two because I really love a character that comes in in the second book, but the first one is really fantastic just for getting the world building going, learning a lot about Lyra, the heroine, and it's just, it's a really, really fantastic thought-provoking, interesting, and unique fantasy series. So 
that's why I'm giving away this one. Okay, you guys, so those are all the books I will be giving away. There will be one winner, and this unfortunately is going to be the U.S. only. I'm shipping them myself, and I live in the U.S., so sorry. If you win these books, you can pick and choose. You don't have to take them all unless you want them all. You can take just one. You can take none. I don't know why you'd enter it if that's the case, but you can have whatever you like. I do not care. I'll be running this giveaway through Rafflecopter, so there's going to be a link below that you guys can follow, and I'm going to do a whole bunch of different ways you can enter for people that follow my blog mostly, or people that follow me on YouTube, or my Twitter followers, or whatever. So there's going to be a lot of different ways you can enter to win. Alright you guys, I hope you guys enter to win and are excited to read some of these. I really just am so excited to take this opportunity to share some of my favorite fantasies rather than just dumping them at some bookstore. So good luck everybody and thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time.